quickly take us through it I'll before I get I'll just show you something beyond the praise the Lord, oh my Lord. <laughs> There's another note, praise the Lord, oh my God, where we have Why one we of not? our good friends there, DJ Soxie, actually wearing <laughs> short and sweet. Short, short and sweet. sweet. And became the talk of town because he appeared wearing this. And that was award, and that became awards. the talking point. No. Of do you guys agree that no. DJ Soxy should have just won that? No. DJ okay. Soxy is, no. is not short and sweet. Queen says no. He's not short and sweet. No, he's not short and sweet. That look was a flop. <laughs> I'm done. Was a flop. Yeah. And okay. done. Short and sweet. <laughs> yes. Um, but, but, but beyond that, uh, this is the, uh, the groove was a success. Uh, like you say, the. <laughs> Gracious, praise the Lord. The ladies are uh, looking the gorgeous. Ladies are looking great. Oh yes. And, and and a good surprise again coming through that um, a young artist actually becomes the artist of the yeah. year mm -hmm. and all that. Mm. And I, I, I'm sure we were supposed to have him here. Yeah. Uh, I'm sure he'll come in coming days. But if you grab the pulse, you'll just see everything that happened in the groove. All right. Uh, as reported mm -hmm. by Fred. Boy, what's the biggest story on the Nairobi today? Today, oh, Waziri Chacha is back. Oh, not <laughs> yes. again. Not and again. Not <laughs> like, again. Waziri Chacha. Waziri Chacha is back and he says uh, he does not use any love potions to lure older women. He doesn't use love potions to, to lure, lure women. Older, older women because he older women Can't like we come up with better pickup lines? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he does not use love potion to, to lure older women. Older women love him and he says dealing with younger women is a problem because they're so materialistic. Sorry. And he runs a charity, we get a new fact, he runs a charity organization for the girl child, mm -hmm. which oh. I said it's wrong. If it was for the older women, the charity will be more oriented to him. You know when we were talking about weddings earlier on yeah. with um, um, Cardi B, yeah. grab the Nairobian, page six, yeah. street lovers wed, spend honeymoon on cold, wet corridor. Mm. It's, the, it's, it's, the, it's the motive that counts. It's, it's, love. Not about, it's not about the millions, I think. That for me should be crowned wedding of the year. <laughs> should be crowned wedding, wedding, of, crowned wedding of the year. You're laughing queen. No, I'm not laughing. See, see, that's the problem. The moment you, you crown them the wedding of the year, everybody comes forth, bonfire, right. whoever, take them to wherever. No, no, no. no. It's, it's, the, it's the motive that counts really, people. Oh. Okay, never mind that my wedding costs <laughs> well. a fortune. But if I were to wed again, I'll just do it in my living room. Oh, you, you'll, you'll do it in your living room? I'll do it in my living room. And Off guess, the set. And guess, I, I would only invest in photography. Right. I yeah. mean, trust Nairobi. <laughs> you guys have really interesting <laughs> stories. Hubby stabs wife after busting her kissing stranger. My gosh, my yeah. gosh. My gosh. Mm. Oh, my goodness. All right, you guys have to grab a copy of this. Um, as we're ending up the show, right. Stevens, are we going for a movie this Friday, today? We are going for a movie, but we're also going for something else. If you get to page uh, four mm -hmm. of the past today, mm -hmm. you see these beautiful cars. You know, the total motor sure show is going will. down. Okay, and okay. so for me, this weekend is about the cars. Okay. Um, big wheels that are actually the real 2018 cars. Fast and the Furious. On, on show, yes. Okay. And um, just a quick comment as I'm getting, I just want, this is going to be the last quick comment <laughs> and I want it from everyone. Yeah. Queen, have you bought meat? Or have you eaten samosa <laughs> and you did? No, it was cut meat. Especially now that we are dealing with counterfeit sugar. And as of yesterday with Matiang, you're saying that, ah, uh, now we have cooking to worry oil. about juice, oil, <laughs> uh, cooking oil to be specific. Um, and what was the other substance that he had mentioned? Cooking oil, juice, tomato, ketchup. Mm. That it could have harmful substances. Jesus. And now we have cut meat to worry about okay. it. Now, if, I, I don't like rats, so. <laughs> <laughs> the moment I realize that I'm beginning to, hmm. to uh, you know, look for rats in my house, probably, uh, I, I don't, at this moment, I can't really tell whether I've consumed cat samosa. <laughs> samosa <laughs> meow. Or sugar with mercury. I have no idea. <laughs> it will, time will tell. <laughs> oh, I don't know. <laughs> I've just had a samosa. I've just had a yes, sweet samosa. Yes, you walked in and just the first thing you even said. <laughs> I just had a sweet samosa. It tastes like it always tasted. So mm. I don't think the samosas I'm eating are the classes. <laughs> That I've been described meow. right now. So, yes, no samosa meow. <laughs> okay, and Boyo? I'm still gonna eat the samosas. The Nakuru people have not died, they have not had any side effects. So, if the cat meat is okay, why not? And really, we've gotten to I'm, that. I'm a meaty <laughs> person. <laughs> Queen, <at you>. so, <laughs> as long as it's tasty, I'm keeping the samosas. <laughs> you are the, oh my gosh, would you eat donkey meat and the other dog meat? As long as it does not kill me and it is tasty and flavorful. Oh, boy, why you can not? eat dog meat. Meet those poor any, little any meat, adorable actually, things. Any meat, she as long as it's not harmful. I'm a meaty person. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm.
we need to talk about this behind the scenes. I feel like there's something that we need to fix somewhere. Mm -mm. What plans do you have this weekend, boy? Uh, uh, I've, I've not made any plans. Join me. Yeah. Oh, no, for the motor show? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. But since Queen? Yes. There's something I wanted to say. This guy, this Nakuru guy, is going to jail for three years. <laughs> yeah, it's sad. And he's just saying he was trying to make a living. He didn't even know that selling cut meat is, 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 is illegal. <laughs> it's sad. Somebody told me. Did you, see, did you yeah. see the memes? How he was lowering the cuts. I know. Did you not see the memes online? <laughs> Kenyans, it's always a fun filled time with Kenyans online. Yeah. Oh my goodness. So, the thing is, um, oh. you said he was selling them for how long? Seven years? Yeah, he sold them since 2012. Oh my goodness. And he was just trying to make a living. And each cut goes for around 500. You know, I think it's a better thing to do with a cut. I mean, make money. Don't just put it in the city room. You are all the cards. But, why is, what, but why is he being jailed for three years and people are, run, I just uh, wonder, people, maybe, people are running around with billions of... Okay, a walking squad. For, maybe they want okay. to go and feed him with more samosa. Okay. Okay. okay, you know, guys, we're going to leave it on that <laughs> We really need to go take a look at our kitchen. With all these counterfeits, yes. I just go clean your kitchen. <laughs> all right, that has been um, the Hot Topics crew. Of course, I had Queen, who is an editor here at The Standard, Stevens Mwendo, who is an editor with The Pulse, and Boyo, who is a writer with The Nairobi, and taking us through the Hot Topics of the Week, the top story within um, the pop culture scene and should I say our shelves at this rate. This morning on Morning Express we were asking you what do you think is ailing the Jubilee party? We were asking you what do you think is ailing the Jubilee party? A lot of you have been sending your honest raw feedback. Okwemba you say succession. It's as simple as that. Um, one tweet reads, Jubilee leaders suspecting of betrayals amongst themselves, which is leading to greed of power. Uh, Peter, you say corruption, greedy politicians, lack of vision, tribalism, nepotism, bad characters and manners. Um, and I think that's where we will close off with that. Oh, um, Okebe, you say the handshake. All right. The handshake again by, the, uh, by a gentleman who is going by the name Armour Bear, an interesting username. Um, but thank you so much for your feedback. Jubilee government is the first in Africa to expose the darkness in leadership. All these scandals gives hope to the future generations. It's our duty to not only fight corruption, but to kill and bury it. A lot of your feedback, honest and raw feedback. I really appreciate it. From the Money Express team and myself, Zinzi Kibiku, this is where we say goodbye. Up next, it is News Center. I'll see you tomorrow morning for Weekend Express. Bye-bye.